Fangraphs, Kylie McDaniel. Overall, the system boasts a lot of high ceiling, high risk teenagers that could be stars if they pan out, but is short on high floor, major league close pieces. The long, in Higgin, and short of it is the farm has a ton of upside, but not many good bets. NJ.com, Brendan Cuddy, related to prospect rankings as Keith Law's take on Jonathan Loisiga. Despite leaving Lasagna off his own top 100, Law admits that the biggest obstacle to Lois Ega's success in the majors is his health, not stuff or performance. Sports Illustrated, Michael Beller, the Yankees' biggest off-season acquisition looks like it'll be James Paxton. The big left-hander played in a relatively quiet market in Seattle, but is poised to have a big season and become a much more discussed player around baseball. Yes Network, the Yankees released their list of 21 non-roster invitees to spring training. Among that group is 31-year-old Danny Farquhar, given clearance to play again after losing most of 2018 to a brain aneurysm. It's one of the most frightening things that can happen to your body and I'm happy Danny is back to feeling like himself. He could fill a good role as bullpen depth for a club in 2019.